How's everybody doing? It's the Hawking Regime here, and today I'm coming at you guys with some more Madden NFL 16 content. And today we are doing a 51 badge pack opening from pretty much nothing. Um, if you go to the marketplace and you buy all of the bronze player replacements options that they give you, I think you can get at least um, 12 of those two badge pack openings that you see on your left right there. But we are just going to get straight into it. Um, that is the way to get him and uh, this is just an extremely good effective way uh, To get badges in the game, you know, you can basically get them for free because The player replacements are like 25 coins and they go into a set where if you add 10 bronze players you get Excuse me. You get a One two badge pack and I was able to get like 18 of them or something crazy like that And then I had enough this and then I had like some silver and extra gold players that I put in to get some extra amounts too but this is i mean if if badge prices start to skyrocket i mean that's when you want to start st selling these things and make tons of profit uh just from i mean pretty much nothing you can get i think you can get 12 badge packs um and those badge packs include two badges so uh 24 badges i believe i'm not positive i believe that's a roughly what it is uh it might be way less than that or way more i'm not exactly certain but um you can get some nice badges from uh, just simply buying out all of the player replacement cards that are bronze in the marketplace and uh, then putting them into the set of the two badge pack and getting these uh, packs which obviously give you nice badges and there's, there's a chance you can get elite badges obviously uh, you see I'm pulling a lot of golds which are uh, at the moment not worth a whole bunch of money but uh, in the future hopefully they will uh, increase in price I'm not exactly certain when they will but uh, obviously you can assume that they will uh, increase in price once they are um, needed once they are needed to be, to be put into a set that people will really want to complete that like, you know something like uh, I don't know a legend but unfortunately all the legends uh, they don't actually accept badges in their sets it's more legend badges so that's a little bit unfortunate to the price of badges in general but uh, I think at some time they will increase in price which is gonna be extremely beneficial for a lot as you can see I'm pulling up a whole bunch of gold badges and right here, this is where the point where it kind of stops from the two badge packs to the five badge and ten badge pack uh, that I had. And uh, ironically, I think I get better results out of the two badge packs uh, than I did from either of these. So that's, um, I guess, something to consider if you're really wanting to get all these badges. Just go for the bronze cards early on. And it's going to be extremely, you're going to get so many badges uh, if you buy packs of the game. Because, you know, basically you get a bronze card every time. You see, I get three gold badges out of this ten badge pack right here. I feel like I've said badges a billion times in this video, but uh, you know this is something that you can easily get. Once again, you don't you don't even need to have a whole bunch of coins. I think I was like two thousand coins to get uh, all of the players bought in the marketplace. And then you just look at how many badges I have. It's gonna be ridiculous once I actually sell out all these things and uh, get some money out of it. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. You know, make sure to subscribe to my channel for more Mad NFL 16 content. I definitely have been slacking on the videos and the content, so hopefully I'll be able to get back to my regular methods and regular ways uh, this, this weekend. Uh, and then once again, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. And yep, thanks for watching.